everyone. So I'm back home for the summer, well for three weeks until I go to New York. So this is my bedroom at home. I know most of you guys know that, but just in case you don't. Um, I just did the tutorial that was on my new eyeshadow trio from Spell Cosmetics. Um, I was wearing this in kind of a recent haul video maybe, and I got a ton of requests to use it in a tutorial, so I just decided to do it. And then I also use one of my lip glosses. And I'm going to put the link in the sidebar where you can get these if you want them. And I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. Yeah. And I'm going to do a vlog right now. So I've been really unproductive the entire day. I haven't done anything. So I'm like finally like kind of waking up because I'm such like a night person. So I'm going to try to do a couple videos just because I haven't done them in forever so long. So I love you guys so much. Bunches and bunches. So enjoy this and I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Okay, so I'm going to start with a little bit of Artifact Paint Pot from MAC. It's a really dark red. And I'm just going to put a tiny bit of this on the outer corner of my lid as a base. I'm pretty sure there's a bug back there because both cats are like really trying to get some things. So there's probably a flying bug. You go cats! Okay, so after you have like a really light layer of that, you don't want too much because we're not really going for a really dramatic right now. We're going to take the color Ellie's Lullaby from Spell Cosmetics. This is the brush I'm going to be using. I'm using this for all three colors. This is from Coastal Scents. And it just looks like that. I don't know what the name of it is. But I know it wasn't very expensive. It was probably only a couple of dollars. And whew, I'm going to put this on the inner half of my lid. They're causing a ruckus. This is just a really shimmery silver pink color. It's like a gray. It's like a it's like a shimmery gray. I'm putting that on the inner corner and on the lid the first half. Okay, next I'm going to take Bitten. This is another color in my trio. And this is just a dark shimmery red color. It's like a copper red. And I'm going to put it on the rest of my lid. Blending it into the first color. And blending any harsh edges out. I'm also going to take just a tiny bit of this and put it right underneath my eye. Okay. Then to make this a little bit darker, to kind of make the crease color a little bit darker, I'm going to use the color 100 Strokes for MAC. This was limited edition, but any really dark kind of chocolate brown slash deep burgundy color would work. I'm using the same brush. And I'm just going to kind of put this on the outer V. So draw a line up like that. And then over. And then we're going to blend it all in. To that outer corner. There really must be a bug that they're like trying to get. Okay, so when you have it like that... I'm going to take a fluffy blending brush. This is the MAC 224. And we're just going to blend it all out. Next, I'm just going to use a matte highlight color. This is Brulee. And this is what's really going to tone down the edges. Oh my gosh, they are driving me nuts. They are like jumping all over the place and... Next, I'm going to take a liner. This is Raven Coal Power by MAC. Um, it's like a really dark black red. There's one in the permanent line called, I believe, Foxy Lady, which is pretty much the same thing. And I'm going to put this on the waterline. And also the upper line. And I already had L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara on from earlier, so I'm not going to add any more mascara. For blush, I'm going to use Feeling Beauty Powder Blush, which is kind of just like a plummy color. It's really pretty. 
I actually have a blush that's with this collection. It's from Do I Dazzle You, but I don't have it yet or I would use it. And then for lips, I'm going to use my own gloss. This is Elalie's Lullaby from Spell. And that completes this look. So um, thank you guys for watching. And I'm going to do a vlog right now. So yeah, I'll put these up tonight. So I love you guys. Bye.